For over 250,000 years, one predator reigned across the Americas, larger than a gray wolf, stronger, and now, no longer extinct. This is the story of the dire wolf. Dire wolves, Canis drus, first appeared during the late Pleistocene. Contrary to popular belief, they weren't just oversized gray wolves. They were a separate species, shaped by different evolutionary pressures. Weighing up to 150 pounds, dire wolves were built for power, not speed. With massive jaws and bone-crushing teeth, they hunted Ice Age giants, bison, camels, even giant sloths. Then, the world changed. As the Ice Age ended, so did their food supply. Climate shifts, human pressure, and competition from faster wolves spelled extinction. By 9500 BC, the dire wolf was gone. For decades, dire wolves lived only in fossils and legend. But in 2025, colossal biosciences made headlines. Using ancient DNA and gene editing, they created the first dire wolf pups in over 10,000 years. These aren't clones, they're genetic reconstructions. Crafted with care, raised in protected preserves, and monitored every step of the way, their return poses questions we've never faced before. What happens when we bring the past into the present? Should we undo extinction? The Ice Age never truly ended. Some of it just woke back up.